before we start, just a little disclaimer. I'm not a nutritionist or a dietitian. The food that I eat works for me and my body. Please seek a certified specialist if you are in need of nutritional advice. For breakfast, I had protein oats, so I just added some chia seeds for protein and a fiber, and a scoop of chai vegan protein. It's really good actually, especially with oats. I like to mix all my dry ingredients first, makes it way easier when mixing the almond milk. So I use almond milk with no sugar. It makes it a lot creamier than just using plain water. Now that's ready to go. I put it on medium heat for about 10, 15 minutes. And when it's all done, I usually have a big serving, a few scoops. This meal is perfect before the gym, before a big workout, so I like to load it up with fruit. So I'm having raspberries and banana. And of course, a little bit of honey, just for some sweetness. This meal is super filling and it will give you enough energy for your workout and it's packed with nutrients. Now it's time for the gym, so today's a leg day, which means I'll be eating a lot, so stay tuned. After the gym, I had a protein shake from the little cafe that's attached to the gym. So I had vanilla protein with some almond milk and it was amazing, incredible. For an afternoon snack, I had a dragon fruit and I had about half of it, but wow, it was delicious, super sweet. Today was a busy work day, so I decided to order a salad. I had a lettuce mix with quinoa and chicken. And I added broccoli, some coleslaw and carrots, some beans, some pasta, some cucumber and Caesar dressing, croutons, amazing. I ordered a medium, but when it came, obviously it was huge, so I had about three quarters of this. Um, it was delicious though, super filling. Wow. <laughs> After lunch, I decided to have some crackers and cream cheese. I was probably bored, this is why I'm eating, but I did have a big workout, so it was worth it. And I added some cucumber and pepper, so delicious. In the early evening, I decided to have a fruit bowl, so I cut up some pineapple and this one was super sweet. I added some green grapes and basically demolished this whole bowl. For dinner, I made some Greek meatballs, so you want to start off with some minced meat and crack an egg in there. Then I added some diced white and red onion, parsley and garlic. I added some garlic powder, plenty of that and lots of oregano or oregano. This is my secret ingredient. Trust me, it is so delicious in your meatballs. And of course, salt and pepper to taste. Now it's time to mix it all together. So make sure you have washed your hands. This may take a little while. By the end of it, it should look like this. And you just want to roll them up into medium-sized balls. I'm Swedish, so I'm an expert at this. And this makes enough to serve two people. You want to put your pan on medium heat with some olive oil and swirl it around. Now the most satisfying part is aligning them all in the pan evenly and symmetrically. For carbs, I made some quinoa with one part quinoa, two parts water. While that was cooking, I made some tzatziki, so I sprinkled some salt over cut up cucumber, draws out all the water. Then I used some low fat, no sugar Greek yogurt and began to mix the cucumber in there. This took a little while. I'm not sure why I used a plate, but I did. <laughs> so I then added some salt and pepper to taste. When the bottom was nice and brown, I flipped them and they were smelling so delicious. Then I made a little Greek salad with some lettuce mix and some green peppers or capsicum where I'm from. I added some cucumber and some red onion. And of course some tomatoes. And of course, wouldn't be a Greek salad without some feta. This is the only feta I can find in Mexico. So this is what it looks like. So delicious and good for you. 
Now it's time to plate up. So I gave myself four meatballs and the quinoa came out a little bit thick, but it's okay. Then I sprinkled some parsley for the aesthetic and I added the tzatziki of course and oh my god it's just it just came together so nicely especially with the Greek salad and this was my dinner packed with protein and nutrients and that's all I ate in a day thank you so much for watching if you liked it give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe bye